Hello everybody, welcome back to EU4, I'm Paradox Gamer, playing live on Twitch, protected market achievement as Genoa, and we have the mission to take Alexandria, which will give us tumor cancelism, and Alexandria is a pretty nice province to have, although it will rebel quite often, I guess. Border tension, gains a claim on Corfu, that's good. And we are fighting on reduced uh, maintenance, that's because we don't really have much money at the moment going around. Um, why do I have troops here? Did I build one more? Yeah. I did. Um, just leave him there. Alexandria has fallen. Okay, let's see how far away we are from actually getting it. Negative 1049. We need at least 10 war score. But other than that, is negative 49. Alright. These guys are heading for Fayum, so I will go to Rosetta. You didn't have enough transports. Ah, okay. Yeah, I have only 14 transports. El Gabia is over. Oh, the siege is over. Let's head for Damietta. This is going well. It was the right time to do it, I guess. Um, we are saving up some money here, but not much. Might be able to pay, repay a loan. Let's see how big it is. 52. Let's go ahead and do that. Save a little bit on interest. So we are making one docket now. Papal State has arrived with one regiment. Pretty easy war when everyone else is taking care of the enemy, of the army, yeah. It's a pretty standard attack on the Mamluks. Always wait for the Ottomans to kick in, and in this particular case, everybody's kicking on them. I mean, take as many sieges as possible before uh, they siege out, uh, sue, sue for peace. Siege out. Aragon is in Syria. Oh my god. Crimean pretender rebels, I'm not gonna do anything about that. Just let them rebel. And here's the Mamluk navy. <laughs> just, just sail away as far as away as it could. Siege of Rosetta is done, we'll head for Um, Ras Scrape, I guess. Damietta is done, let's head for Sinai. Or Jerusalem. No, there's already someone there. Right, head for Sinai. And we actually don't need the fleet here anymore because, um, well, we might when the others peace out. Let's just keep it there. We're keeping the manpower stable. Another election. We have 55. I want to keep it above 50, so I'm going to choose the admin. Another admin guy. And uh, do we have enough points for the first one? 
I think I'll take economic first and then religious after that. I don't even know if I want to stay Catholic. I think I want to I want to switch to um, Orthodox. After the next war with the Ottomans, we'll clear out Greece and then uh, move the capital to Constantinople. Uh, did you make Jerusalem king achievement? Watched a series with the knights. Um, almost. I didn't get it, but um, it was down to bad luck. So and I haven't redone it since that. I was I was very very close to getting it. Okay, let's take economic. And 358. We can almost take the first one, which is national tax plus 10%. No, I need 400. Okay. No discount. A promise of safe passage. Uh, I did do the other one though, the Holy Trinity, um, which is the same approach, more or less, and I did get that one. So, gain 50 diplomat or 10 payball. I'll go for the diplomat. Speaking of which, we have 70 points we can spend on something. 400 manpower. Um, interest per annum, 10 prestige. Nah, it's not really worth it. I like the stability one at a hundred. All right, we got a sizable uh, piece of land sieged out, so I think we'll be okay, even though the others piece out. Herald from the Ottomans, new ruler. It's very rare that I siege out an uh, enemy land with reduced um, <laughs> maintenance. But there you go. The trial. Lose some points and gain 5 Republican tradition. Or lose 5 and gain 30 points. 40 points, that's a lot. 40, 80, that's 120 points. No, that's not worth it. Just do it like that. But as Christian, you can get one mercantilism per 100 papal influence. Yeah, that is true. That is actually true. And as the number of Catholic states diminish, we actually we can get more influence quicker. That's a pretty good point. Okay, we can take it now, but I need some admin points to core Alexandria. Well, actually, I only need to own it to get that um, mechanicalism. Then I can always sell it back to them and then repeat the mission. And since I don't have religious, there's no way I can hold on to this anyway. So I might just um, sell it back. Because I'm pretty sure I only need to own it. Yep. Let's hang on a second for that. Let's see, are they even even willing to uh, sue for peace? Oh yeah, they are. What if we add some money? Seventy-six ducats and Alexandria. They would uh, actually agree to that right now. Ten aggressive expansion in the Orient only, and we'll just sell it back to them. All right, send demand. Gain two mercantilism.
and then wait for the um, diplomat and then sell it back. Let's head for Alexandria. Tuscany have taken Siena back. Now they've uh, Pisa back. Now they're fighting Siena. Oh my god, how can they get it back so quickly? Hmm. No, oh, that was um that was fun. Next quest would be Tangiers. Wonder if there's also an easy war available. Yeah, Tangiers and also Tunis is possible. I already own Constantinople, so that mission is is not available. But I'd rather just own Constantinople. Uh, Crimea, boom boom. Yeah, that's fine. And uh, that's because they have that huge army. They can't support it though, so they'll have to um, get rid of it anyway. Okay, we can talk to these guys on January 29th. Sell province. Oh, I can't as long as they are at war. We'll just stay here for now then. New mission. Trade Trumbull in Tangiers. Now let's check out tra Tangiers. Okay. Um, it's got a Portuguese core. Or claim. No, it's actually a core. And they're fighting Portugal and Castile right now. So, unless I can um, steal it, I can try to move my men over there and see if I can actually land there before I take the mission. Let's try that. Get on the boats. Sail over there. See how that pans out. Hi, an elder view. Welcome to the chat. Maybe I can sell it to someone else. Who would want to buy that? Uh, what about Tunis? Rivalry. Ottomans, same. I'm gonna have to wait for them. What about Syria? We have a truce. Oh, they're still at war as well. Okay. Still nobody in Tangiers. Can you release it as a nation? I don't think I can now. Because Mamlocks already exist. I could core it for uh, easier conquest next time. That would cost 54 dip uh, admin. And the core will go away eventually. So, there you go. Alright, let's see here. That would be really fortunate if I could actually just land in ten years. It looks like it. I think we should do it. So we'll just grab the mission. That gives us the claim. Then we can attack. Aragon will still help and it will bring in Tunis. 
which is uh, a bit unfortunate, but okay, that's fine. And then we just simply just land in ten years. And hopefully nobody else will get there before us. And we're black flagged. That's the new rule, right? Uh, you, you used to not be black flagged on ships. But that is not the case anymore. I have to, and I can't even use my ally. I have to go all the way back to like Corsica and then back. Uh, that's crappy. I have to actually land here or in Liguria, doesn't matter. And then come back. And then, of course, somebody else will be in 10 years at that point. We can still hope, but um, maybe Aragon will land there. We'll see. Let's go all the way back. There we go. Removes the black flag. Get back on the ship. Move back. And we'll see what happened in the meantime. Oh, I did lose some ships to Tunis, I guess. Yeah. My botches. Low morale and all. Let's see what happened in the meantime. Portugal's got ships there, but they have no troops on them. That means we can uh, make another attempt at landing. We'll land on September 4th, one month. Oh, we made it. Alright, let's get that siege down. What kind of uh, army do they have left? We got quite a few, but it's mostly Tunis. Yeah, Morocco actually only have two. So let's go siege out something else. Uh, split in two. We can take out one regiment, even with low morale. Yeah. And then head for Dukala. Alexandria, uh, I mean uh, Cairo. <laughs> Mamluks still at war. And Aragon has uh, attacked Tunis instead. That is fine. So our current mechanicalism is at 34. And we can keep doing these missions for two, uh, two points each every time. That's why Genoa is the best one for these missions. Uh, we do have 50% Caucasian uh, nationalists. Why do we have Caucasian nationalists? Is that in here? Well, let's get rid of that. What are these guys? Crimean Patriots. That's actually quite good if they can succeed. That'll give the uh, land to Crimea. Golden Horde is still a thing. Koro Khan is now following. Thank you, Koro Khan. Welcome to the stream. I don't know if I need to do this because Crimean Patriots they'll just give it to Crimea, I guess, so does that really matter? Fourteen years. I think we'll just up the autonomy there as well. And then we have Egyptian Patriots. There's nothing we can do about them. 
All right, stabilization. And that's the end of the episode. We'll continue the war with Morocco in the next one. See you guys. Bye-bye.